Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the club. It's bell time. My name is Drew Kazoo, joined at this time by Joe Business and Mark Green. And here we go, ladies and gentlemen. We have got the El Mundo Championship ready to be defended here. Fenway Park, Mass Hole, Toto Loco. For a lot of people here, this is the reason that they showed up. Oh, I cannot wait for this. They're just going to beat the hell out of each other. One of the greatest rivalries in New England wrestling history. Second year in a row, these two have done battle for this very championship here at Fenway Park. No one will forget last year, re former reality star Richard Hatch lending uh, the assist to the mass old Mike McCarthy, helping him win that El Mundo title. But this year, no reality stars. Nope, he's got to do Just it all Total Loco time. and the mass hole. Winner take all the El Mundo title on the line. Can Toto Loco regain that title from a man? And you uh, say what you want about the mass hole, Mike McCarthy. He takes a great amount of pride in being El Mundo champion. He takes that title with him everywhere. He shows it off. He is very proud to be the El Mundo champion. And that music sounds the champ and a homecoming. And there he is, the hometown favorite, the mass hole, Mike McCarthy. I'll tell you what, I have watched this guy for most of his career, from all the way back to the WrestlePlex in Rhode Island and the Super Juniors Tournament down there to where he is now, one of the best in New England. It's a meteoric rise, it's a great story, and it's something he can be very, very proud of. He's Absolutely, so Mark. And the proof is in the pudding because around his waist is that El Mundo Boston championship belt. As a matter of fact, if you remember, he won it at this very event last year. Yeah, we already talked about that, Joe. You missed it. But that's okay. Hi. This year. Good. No Richard Hatch this year. Oh, it's the Massels coming over knocking our drinks down. He's just showing some Like love. I said, this guy's a total jerk. Taking the ring apart, knocking drinks down. Living up to his name and his moniker, the mass hole. You know, we've had a lot of fun out here tonight, but this is serious. This Forget is the, the appearance. Mike McCarthy is a master technician. and Absolutely. You are going to see probably the best wrestling you've seen in New England this match. He's got in the black and gold. This is the match that was on the poster for a reason. This has all the gold on the line, all the stakes, all the history. I cannot wait for this one. These two tore the house down here last year. Yeah. I'm still trying to find out where Tokyo, Mexico is. Uh, right next to Tijuana. Ah. It's right next to Tijuana, China. There he is, the champ, the king of oi style. He is unorthodox. He'll go from a wrist lock to putting a booger on you. Absolutely. But that is what has made the mass hole successful through the years. And you would think he would be the favorite in Fenway Park, but not the case. That's sort of a mixed reaction for both guys, I think. Here we go. All the marbles. You can just feel it. Big fight feel in the air here. Absolutely. Crowd is jacked up. We are ready to go. El Mundo Heavyweight Championship on the line. Can Toto Loco recapture the gold he lost one year ago at Fenway Park? He is amped up. Look at him. He is fired up, chomping at the bit to get his hands on McCarthy. He feels like he was robbed a year ago. He has been dying to get his hands on McCarthy ever since then. And McCarthy clearly in no rush. That was a clean this victory going. the way I saw it last year. And McCarthy, McCarthy is now playing deck. mind games, getting into the head of Toto Loco. He's going to start when he wants to start. Hey, when you're the champion, you dictate the pace. You dictate the rules. And that's what he's doing. He's just taking his time. Look. 
Let's bear in mind though that the mass hole Mike McCarthy does not have to win this match. Toto Loco has to pin or submit the mass hole. Very good point. The Toto Loco is just ready to go. He wants this so wow. More mind games. Sporting the new merch. Yeah, it's surveying the crowd. And keep an eye on that shoulder of McCarthy. He's got that wrapped up. Something's wrong with that shoulder. We don't know. I didn't get any medical report on it. But that is a big, big target for Toto Loco. Absolutely. And wow. you know that he's well aware of that. Wait a minute. Oh, there we go. Just Strike like you first. said, Mind Game baited him right into that trap. And the muscle. Oh, my goodness. Hard shot. Oh. Uh, McCarthy taunt the crowd. Toto Loco now showing that quickness. Off that that unorthodox style. Up and over by Toto Loco. Hits the Alps on the other side. Comes back. Hip toss block, hip toss block. Toto Loco flips those like legs over. Playing pinball. Ducks the clothesline. Whoa. Maybe, oh, drops Man. that rope, and McCarthy takes a trip to the floor. Watch out. Stay Toto Loco going to fly. Suicide dive. Nice. Nice move. Risking life and limb there. Yeah, there's nothing mixed about that reaction, uh, Mark. No, Bell Time Club faithful firmly behind Toto Loco. Oh, McCarthy goes Whoa. on the bricks and mortar. He's out amongst the people. Depending on what referees should be exercising his tent count. This isn't a false count anywhere, Matt. I, I'm losing track of them now, and the crowd is just kind of swallowing them up. Yeah, these guys are fighting. They've left the ring, and they are working their way down to the concourse. They could end up out on the stage there. Yeah. Yeah, we don't have a great vantage point, guys. There's not a whole lot we can do here. I'm going to stand up and see what I can see here. Yeah, I'll leave that to you, Kazoo, because uh, I'm not having any luck. I mean, I can see uh, the orange hair of Toto Loco. There you go. That's about all I can make out, though. There's a lot of people out there. I, I lost McCarthy. Oh, there he is. Hard shot there by Toto Loco. Oh, McCarthy these guys, could, these guys could end up out in center field. These guys are going back and forth. We knew this one wasn't going to be a technical marvel. No, we talked about it. So much history, so much bad blood between these two steps. Oh, Last wow. year, oh my God. Wow. It right into that concrete support structure, face Darn first. It. I don't know. That could have even just took him out. But you can't win the uh, title on a count out. I'll I have yet to see McCarthy stand up since then. Oh, no, he's being picked up and dragged around. So without a doubt, Toto Loco is willing to do anything and everything to reclaim that El Mundo Boston Championship. Absolutely. It's prestigious. Wait a minute. Oh, oh there we go. Oh, oh, right across the table. Right in the concession area. Say goodbye to someone's merch. Yeah. This is insane, guys. Oh, what's he doing now? Got to get him in the ring if you want to you wanna keep your time. Wait a minute now. Masso's mom fed him with a slingshot. All right, Loco back at ringside. McCarthy. Wait a minute. Oh, wait, are they going back out again? No. Oh. oh McCarthy messing with the fans. Back in the ring. <laughs> Toto Loco now with those two big kicks. Yeah, he's Irish whip going. into the ropes. Up. Oh, back tilt the world backbreaker. With authority. Into the cover. Only a two count. And you can see uh, on uh, McCarthy's What do you think has more facing? tattoos, the referee or McCarthy? You know what? That's a good question. Toto Loco in control now. You know, I asked all the wrestlers in the back if they had a favorite Fenway memory. And the mass old Mike McCarthy's favorite Fenway memory was beating up jocks outside the Ratskeller Club. Oh, oh, oh my God. That knee just completely gave out on him. Uh-oh, this could be it. Oh, that, 
That's not good. Ladies and gentlemen, that, that knee, I just saw that. That knee bent in a way it's not supposed to bend. Gotta get the medic. We should get That's, the medical staff out here and take a look. We might, we might that is help. not good. We might need help out here from McCarthy. That's not good. Yeah, that's... Hold on a second, folks. This is... We got a bit of a situation here. Guys, McCarthy guys. landed very, very awkward on that leg. That knee twisted up. McCarthy's going to try to get back in there before the count of ten and get this thing going, but... Well, you got to give the tenacity of Mike McCarthy. He's not going to just sit out and lose his title. I mean, guys, I saw it clear as day. That knee just completely buckled and folded under him. It was fairly grotesque, to be honest with you. You can look at it right now, even. It's, it's bent in a weird way. Wait a oh! minute! Oh! Turnabout is fair play. He took a pop. Oh! Look at that. Shaking it off. And the oh. mass just told the Bell Time Club faithful, I'm just a jerk. Trick total loco. Trick total. Oh. oh, my God. What a Did you see? Believable. That stunner on the on the ring apron. That was downright violent. Yeah, that was not fake. I'll and tell now you what, it's Toto Loco that we need to go check on. I'll tell you what, I'm a very skeptical individual, and he got me with that one. The way his knee folded when he landed was sickening. It Absolutely. Was. That's dedication. Maybe he's double jointed or something. I don't know. That was interesting. Well, whatever it is, the tactic worked, and the mass hole Mike McCarthy is firmly in control of this contest now. As he throws Toto Loco back into the ring. Although, here's the thing. If you're McCarthy, why don't you just completely continue to sell that the knees hurt? Double underhook. Butterfly suplex. But why do you sell the injury, Sell the, take the 10 count, take your title, and go home? It works. I don't know why he didn't do that. If that was his objective. Well, I'm not going to question the wisdom of the mass hole. He's the Amundo Boston champion for a reason. I think Mike McCarthy just enjoys putting the screws to people. Anything to needle the, you know. That's probably true. Well, I told you, I've seen him put his body at risk to there flip and hurt other people. I've seen him punch people's lights out, and this was all before he got into professional wrestling. So that's just a little uh, window into the character of Mike McCarthy. Yeah, he's a tough guy. I don't think Mike McCarthy has any character. I'll tell you what, he is hardcore to the bone, the king of voice style. Total Loco up, and I... Oh, oh God. my God! Oh. And a really, really hard land in there for Toto Loco on the oh. apron. That uppercut almost took his head off. I'm not sure if you're aware that's the hardest part of the ring. I've heard. I have there. heard. Here we go. McCarthy One, hooks both two. legs. Two. Only a two count. Long two. Oh, you can see the welts forming on the back of Toto Loco after that fall. And McCarthy lit out some kind of growl which was quite interesting. So much punishment being dished out from both up. sides. Yeah, he did. Oh. This is not a fan of Joe Business at all. Big stomp no, to the not. ribs there. Well, you better watch out on your way back. I don't, I'm not walking out with you. Oh, oh wow. nice. Him out. Here we go. Oh, that's right got that short lariat. One, that was into the cover. So close. As brutal as it was, that's not enough to put away the uh, Toto Loco still in this Joe. contest. Yeah, I don't want to be on the receiving end of that. I don't want to really be on the receiving end of anything we've seen here tonight from these guys. Well, the wild man from Tokyo, Mexico needs to pull it together here. If he oh, wants to Mexican walk out of here man. with the title. Wow, hard nice forearm ball. shot. Those well-placed kicks. Oh. Ooh. Well, I got to tell you. And I, I think I'm, we know what we're going to see here, Joe Business. Yeah. Uh -oh. Are we going to see the 617? I think we can call it. Calling for it. Here it comes. Got the, your number. Oh. oh. At least you didn't put a booger on him. That's Not true. yet. 
That's a true Bostonian. It's match. still early in the match. Well, we have yet to see a booger in this players. match. I'm, I'll, I'll be happy with that. Who knows when he'll do it? All right, no puns oh, in this match. Okay. Who no, no puns in this match. McCarthy hard to the outside now. Yeah, and to the delight of the crowd on this one. Yeah, McCarthy went for that slingshot. Go Loco for the cut him off, and now Loco has already done that dive once and paid yeah. the price this time. That's what happens when you go to the well too many times. He showed it to McCarthy once, and McCarthy is quite adept at recognizing and reacting. I think he might up. be going for that jumping DDT. That yep. stage dive DDT. Here we go. Here it comes. Loco! Loco had that scout and came up with the drop kick and takes the asshole out of the match for the time being. Yeah, McCarthy did not expect that at all. That was a nice trick that Toto Loco pulled out, but he better have more. Both men down. Who's going to make it to their feet first? The champion doesn't have to rush. All the urgency is on Toto Loco. And Toto Loco's to his feet first. Trying to get to his feet, the mass hole trying as well. Oh, big chop by McCarthy. Yep. I'll tell you what, we have yet to see Toto Loco go after that clearly injured shoulder. Oh, oh. big forearm by McCarthy. And Toto, Toto Loco saying, bring it on. Blocked that one, fired off one of his own, now the kicks. Those educated feet of Toto Loco. Sends McCarthy into the corner. No, oh, McCarthy is not even with it right now. Ducks the clothesline off the other side, catches him. Heart attack style clothesline into the cover. Two. No wasted motion by Toto Loco. Hit that clothesline, roll right into the cover. Right, not you also got to wonder how long McCarthy's shoulder's going to hold up. Every time he kicks out, he has to expend energy on That's that bruised shoulder. That's, That's an true. excellent point. We're waiting to see if Toto Loco is going to capitalize on it. So far, he hasn't. I know. That's why I made it. Oh! Beautiful in Here we go. Got him up. Going up. Ow! Dropped hard. Nothing fancy about that. I've seen Toto all. Loco win many matches go. with that very move. Has the back press. Two. Oh, oh, no. We almost saw the title change hands there. That was closer than close. And Massel's in a bad way. He's just trying to get back to his feet, giving Toto Loco the break, the break that he needed. He's going to have to dig down deep into the reserves right now. We've seen him before. We've seen him battle back against adversity. Let's see oh. if he can do it here today at historic Fenway Park and leave here with that El Mundo Boston heavyweight championship. Well, Wait a minute. Rope. He's going to meet him up top there. With, got him hooked. Turn can run it. Oh, oh. Hooked the rope. Ow. McCarthy hooked the ropes and blocked it. And now do we got that stage time DDT. Yes. Beautiful. Spike That's going to do it. That's it. That's it. That's all One, she wrote, folks. One, two, two three. No! No! Toto Loco kicks out. I cannot Somehow, believe what I've way. just seen. I think that would put everyone down. Wow. Toto Loco kicked out of that stage dive DDT. McCarthy's got to be wondering. What's left? Yeah, what can I do now? Yeah. Oh, no, no, Rolls reversal. him up. One, One two. two. No. Whoa. Unbelievable match here, folks. What a great contest we're witnessing. Mike McCarthy on, on spaghetti legs. Here we go. Looks for half and half. Oh. Got it. Wow. Got the half and half on Toto Loco. Could That's be it. Can he roll him over and get the cover? That's it. Not no able to capitalize. Loco oh. able to get to his knees quickly. Is he going for that CTFO? Yes. Uh -oh. Going for that CTFO. Trying to choke him to... Oh, Look at the core and he's got, strength of Toto Loco. Well, he's got that locked in tight. That, he doesn't have the second hand lock, though. He Look. never got both hands locked underneath the jaw. That would have been the difference. Yeah, Toto Loco mark. able to capitalize on that mistake. McCarthy and now was McCarthy on him like in a the corner. Oh, feeds Toto Loco an elbow. Mike going up again. Uh-oh. Yes. Perhaps going to that well again, trying to put away with that stage dive DDT. No. Loco, oh, right upside the head with that boot. The elevation on that kick was impressive. Absolutely. 
Loco has him right where he wants him now. Can you get that hurricane run off the top? Here he goes. Got it. He, he got, got it. He did. McCarthy up to his feet quickly. Loco grabs him. It he got it, it. it that he time. Got it. One, One, two, two three. We got a new five. champion. History has been made here at Fenway Park. Total Loco. Total Loco's has won the El Mundo Boston Heavyweight Championship. He's spent, but he's elated. This was a big redemption day for Total Loco. What an unbelievable match we just saw there, fellas. Two tremendous athletes toe to toe. And the mass hole is going to be an utter shock. He came in thinking this was a home game. And the mass hole leaving empty handed. Toto Loco regains the El Mundo Championship one year after losing it. Wow. I'll tell you, I've seen some amazing championship matches in my life. That was definitely right up there. One with one of the best. It and was. Toto Loco now getting the admir admiration and the adoration of the Bell Time Club faithful here and well deserved as he walks out of here with his new El Mundo Boston Heavyweight Championship. All right, well, for Joe Business and Mark Green, my name is Drew Kazoo. Thank you for everyone watching at home on YouTube, and we will see you next time.